The opposition leader flew into Dagwa LLG in East Sipik province yesterday and thanked East Sipik people in raising Sir Michael Somare for his leadership who led the country into independence. Polya told those who gathered the next generation of leaders must be God-fearing. He said PNG's destiny was established on Christian principles but has not been upheld by successive governments. of loving, of serving, of serving and loving unselfishly, ungreedily, want them care, want them strong the conviction, aim to make him a nation, become a strong nation. Despite receiving one third of his DSIP funds, Mr. Pole presented 10,000 each to the local high school, health center and 5,000 to the women's group. Pole says institutions like courts and police must never be weakened because they are also priority areas. But today, I mean, this is where the leaders of tomorrow must make. He called on PNG's young leaders to avoid bad practices and hold on to good governance to save this country into the next 40 years. We are crossing over from a last four decades to a new decade of 40 years. So as people are making good, but you need to look in on the real meaningful development. Jack Lapave, Junior National, MTV News.